Hello everyone. Today's video on R attack is all about the comprehensive roadmap of artificial intelligence covering everything from the start to the finish. We will break down major topics one by one explaining what artificial intelligence is, its role and why it's so important. Whether you are a tech enthusiast or not, we are here to provide detailed explanations in simple language. We want everyone, regardless of their technical background, to understand and enjoy our content. So if you are curious about artificial intelligence and want to learn in an easy and fun way, make sure to subscribe, like and share our channel. Let's dive into the exciting world of artificial intelligence together. Machine learning. What is machine learning? Machine learning is a subset of artificial intelligence that focuses on building systems that can learn from data. Instead of explicitly programming a computer to perform a task, machine learning algorithms allow the system to learn and improve from experience. Why is machine learning important for artificial intelligence? Machine learning is crucial for artificial intelligence because it provides the ability for machines to learn and adapt without being explicitly programmed for every task. In traditional programming, a human has to write specific instructions for a computer to follow. However, in machine learning, the computer learns patterns and rules from data, enabling it to make decisions or predictions without explicit programming. Role of machine learning in artificial intelligence Pattern recognition Machine learning enables artificial intelligence systems to recognize patterns and make predictions based on data. Adaptability Machine learning allows AI systems to adapt to new information and improve their performance over time. Automation Machine learning enables automation of tasks by training models to perform specific functions without explicit programming. Decision making Machine learning algorithms can be used in artificial intelligence systems to make informed decisions based on data. In summary, machine learning is a critical component of artificial intelligence because it empowers machines to learn, generalize from data and make intelligent decisions without being explicitly programmed for each scenario. It forms the foundation for many artificial intelligence applications from image and speech recognition to recommendation systems and autonomous vehicles. Machine learning involves a step-by-step -step process. Here is a general guide to get you started. Understand the basics. Familiarize yourself with the basic concepts of mathematics, especially linear algebra, calculus, and probability. These are foundational for understanding machine learning algorithms. Learn programming, gain proficiency in a programming language. Python is highly recommended for ML due to its simplicity and extensive libraries such as NUMPY, NumPy, Pandas and Scikit-Learn. Study basic machine learning concepts. Begin with fundamental machine learning concepts like supervised learning, unsupervised learning and reinforcement learning. Understand the difference between classification and regression problems. Explore algorithms. Learn about common machine learning algorithms like linear regression, decision trees and k nearest neighbors. Understand how these algorithms work and when to use them. 
डाइव इन टू डेटा डेटा इज क्रूशल फॉर मशीन लर्निंग लर्न हाउ टू क्लीन प्री प्रोसेस एंड एनालाइज डेटा अंडरस्टैंड फीचर इंजीनियरिंग एंड सिलेक्शन अंडरस्टैंड मॉडल इवेल्युएशन एक्सप्लोर मेट्रिक्स फॉर इवेल्युएटिंग मशीन लर्निंग मॉडल्स सच एज एक्सी प्रिसीजन रिकॉल एंड एफ वन स्कोर अंडरस्टैंड द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ ओवर फिटिंग एंड अंडर फिटिंग एक्सप्लोर स्पेशलाइज टॉपिक्स डिपेंडिंग ऑन योर इंटरेस्ट डेल्व इन टू स्पेशलाइज एरियाज लाइक नेचुरल लैंग्वेज प्रोसेसिंग कंप्यूटर वीएन और री इन्फोर्समेंट लर्निंग ऑनलाइन कोर्सेज एंड रिसोर्सेज टेक एडवांटेज ऑफ ऑनलाइन कोर्सेज एंड रिसोर्सेज प्लेटफॉर्म्स लाइक कोर्सिरा इडीएक्स एंड खान अकेडमी ऑफर एक्सिलेंट कोर्सेज ऑन एम एल रीड रिसर्च पेपर्स स्टे अपडेटेड विद द लेटेस्ट रिसर्च इन मशीन लर्निंग बाय रीडिंग अकेडेमिक पेपर्स दिस कैन डीपन योर अंडरस्टैंडिंग एंड एक्सपोज यू टू एडवांस्ड कॉन्सेप्ट ज्वाइन मशीन लर्निंग कम्युनिटीज एंगेज विद द मशीन लर्निंग कम्युनिटी थ्रू फोरम्स सोशल मीडिया एंड मीटअप्स लर्निंग फ्रॉम अदर्स एंड शेयरिंग एक्सपीरियंसिस कैन बी वैल्यूएबल remember learning machine learning is a gradual process and practical experience is key don't hesitate to experiment with real world data sets and build your projects if you encounter challenges or have specific questions along the way feel free to ask hello viewers now that we have covered our first topic machine learning let me break it down in an easy way machine learning is like teaching a computer to learn by itself using examples instead of giving it repeated instructions like we do with kids it's super important for artificial intelligence because it lets machines learn and decide without being told exactly what to do unlike traditional programming where humans have to specify every step for a computer in machine learning we show the computer patterns in data letting it make decisions on its own think of it as giving freedom to machines to learn from experiences with machine learning artificial intelligence can recognize images understand speech suggest things and even help cars drive themselves without a driver it's a cool way to make technology smarter and more independent i hope i have made machine learning easy to understand thanks once again for tuning in neural networks neural networks are a fundamental component of artificial intelligence and machine learning they are inspired by the structure and functioning of the human brain a neural network consists of interconnected nodes or artificial neurons organized into layers these layers include an input layer one or more hidden layers and an output layer role and importance pattern recognition neural networks are powerful tools for pattern recognition they can identify complex patterns and relationships in data making them suitable for tasks like image and speech recognition non linearity neural networks can capture non linear relationships in data this is particularly important when dealing with complex and high dimensional data sets adaptability neural networks are adaptive and can learn from experience through a process called training where they are exposed to labeled examples neural networks adjust their parameters to improve their performance on a specific task representation learning Neural networks can automatically learn hierarchical representations of data. In deep learning, architectures like convolutional 
neural networks and recurrent neural networks are designed for specific types of data such as images or sequences universal function approximators it's been proven that sufficiently large neural networks can approximate any mathematical function this versatility makes them applicable to a wide range of problems learning neural networks understand the basics learn the basic structure of neural networks including input layers hidden layers and output layers understand the concept of weights and biases activation functions study different activation functions used in neurons such as sigmoid hyperbolic tangent and rectified linear unit loss functions understand loss functions which measure the difference between the predicted output and the actual output common loss functions include mean squared error and cross entropy back propagation learn about the back propagation algorithm which is used to update the weights of the neural network to minimize the loss during training optimization algorithms familiarize yourself with optimization algorithms like gradient descent which are used to find the optimal weights for the neural network deep learning architectures explore architectures like cnns for image related tasks and rnns for sequential data understand how these architectures address specific challenges in different domains frameworks and libraries gain practical experience by using popular deep learning frameworks such as tensorflow or pytorch these frameworks provide high level abstractions for building and training neural networks hands on projects apply your knowledge through hands on projects start with simple tasks and progressively tackle more complex problems online courses and tutorials take advantage of online courses and tutorials focused on neural networks platforms like coursera and edx offer courses that cover the theory and practical aspects experiment and iterate neural networks often involve experimentation try different architectures activation functions and optimization strategies to understand their impact on performance remember learning neural networks is a journey and practical experience is crucial feel free to ask if you have any specific questions or if there is a particular aspect you would like to delve into further hello viewers let's sum up neural networks in a super simple way think of them as mini brains in the world of artificial intelligence with inputs outputs and hidden layers kind of like artificial neurons these smart circuits are awesome at recognizing patterns understanding speech and handling complex data what's cool is that they can learn and adjust themselves just like you and me they are like superheroes that get better over time learning from their own mistakes so neural networks are like brainy superheroes in artificial intelligence understanding patterns tackling complex stuff and improving all the time cool right if you have any questions feel free to ask thank you very much let's go for the next topic deep learning deep learning is a subfield of machine learning that focuses on neural networks with many layers often referred to as deep neural networks the term deep comes from the idea of having many layers between the input and output layers of a neural network 
these deep architectures are capable of learning intricate hierarchical representations of data making them particularly effective for complex tasks role and importance feature learning deep learning excels at automatically learning hierarchical features from data each layer in a deep neural network can learn representations at different levels of abstractions image and speech recognition deep learning has shown remarkable success in image and speech recognition tasks convolutional neural networks cnns are commonly used for image related tasks while recurrent neural network rnns are effective for sequential data like speech natural language processing deep learning has significantly advanced nlp tasks including language translation sentiment analysis and text generation transformers a type of deep learning architecture have become prominent in this domain autonomous systems deep learning is crucial in developing autonomous systems such as self driving cars and robots it enables these systems to perceive and understand their environment healthcare and biomedicine deep learning is applied to analyze medical images predict disease outcomes and discover patterns in large scale biological data games and strategy deep learning has demonstrated success in mastering complex games such as go and chess deep reinforcement learning is used to train agents to play games at a high level learning deep learning foundation in machine learning before delving into deep learning ensure a solid understanding of machine learning fundamentals as deep learning builds upon these concepts neural networks understand the basics of neural networks as deep learning primarily involves the use of deep neural networks deep neural network architectures convolutional neural networks cnns used for image related tasks recurrent neural networks rnns suitable for sequential data long short term memory lstm and gated recurrent unit gru specialized architectures for handling sequential data with long term dependencies transformers effective for nlp tasks frameworks and tools familiarize yourself with deep learning frameworks like tensorflow and pytorch these frameworks provide high level abstractions and tools for building and training deep neural networks loss functions and optimization understand different loss functions used in deep learning and how optimization algorithms like gradient descent work in the context of deep networks transfer learning learn about transfer learning a technique where pre-trained models on large data sets are adapted for specific tasks with smaller data sets this is particularly useful when working with limited data hands-on projects apply your knowledge through hands-on projects this could involve image classification natural language processing tasks or any domain of interest online courses and tutorials take advantage of online courses focused on deep learning many platforms offer comprehensive courses that cover both the theory and practical aspects stay updated deep learning is a rapidly evolving field stay updated with the latest research papers and advancements in deep learning experiment and iterate experiment with different architectures hyperparameters and datasets deep learning often involves a degree of experimentation to find the most effective solutions remember 
Deep learning can be complex, but taking it step by step and gradually building your understanding through practical application is key. Hello viewers, so far we have been diving into the fascinating world of deep learning. Think of it as giving machines a super brain with lots of layers. We call these layers deep neural networks. These tech superheroes are incredible at figuring out complex tasks like recognizing images, understanding speech, and even playing games. They play a crucial role in self-driving cars too. Remember, everything we are learning is connected, like pieces of a puzzle fitting together. No need to be confused. We are building a solid understanding step by step. Ready for the next exciting topic? Let's dive in. Natural language processing. Natural language processing is a field of artificial intelligence that focuses on the interaction between computers and human language. The goal is to enable computers to understand, interpret and generate human language in a way that is both meaningful and contextual relevant. Role and Importance Text Understanding NLP allows computers to understand the meaning behind text. This includes tasks such as sentiment analysis, named entity recognition and text classification, speech recognition. NLP is used in speech recognition systems to convert spoken language into written text. This is applied in virtual assistants, transcription services and more. Machine Translation NLP plays a crucial role in machine translation allowing systems to automatically translate text from one language to another. Question Answering Systems NLP is employed in systems that can understand and answer questions posed in natural language. This is used in chatbots, virtual assistants, and information retrieval systems. Summarization Natural language processing is applied to automatically generate concise summaries of large bodies of text, making it easier for users to extract key information. Language generation NLP can be used for language generation tasks such as generating human-like text or creative writing. Named Entity Recognition NER, identifying entities such as names, locations and organizations within text is a key task in NLP. Sentiment Analysis NLP is utilized to determine the sentiment expressed in a piece of text, whether it's positive, negative or neutral. Learning Natural Language Processing Basics of Natural Language Processing Understand the basic concepts of natural language processing including tokenization, stemming, lemmatization and part of speech tagging. Text Pre-Processing Learn how to pre-process text data by cleaning, tokenizing and converting text into a format suitable for analysis. Natural Language Process Libraries Familiarize yourself with NLP libraries in Python such as NLTK, Natural Language Toolkit and Spacey. Statistical and Machine Learning Models Explore statistical and machine learning models used in NLP including naive base support vector machines and more advanced techniques like deep learning. Word embeddings Understand word embeddings which represent words as vectors in a continuous vector space. Word to VEC and GLOVE are popular word embedding techniques. Named Entity Recognition NER 
learned about ner and how it can be used to extract entities from text sentiment analysis explore sentiment analysis techniques from rule based approaches to machine learning models trained on labeled data sets language models understand language models including pre trained models like gpt generative pre trained transformer for various nlp tasks deep learning for nlp delve into deep learning architectures for nlp including recurrent neural networks rnns long short term memory networks lstms and transformers hands on projects apply your knowledge through practical projects this could involve sentiment analysis text classification or building a simple chatbot stay updated nlp is a rapidly evolving field stay informed about the latest research papers conferences and advancements in nlp hello everyone now let's dive into the fascinating world of natural language processing nlp is like giving computers the magical ability to understand human language it's the tech that makes computers smart with text spoken words and even creating meaningful language just imagine computers that can read sentiments in text recognize names and places translate languages answer your questions NLP is the genius behind all of these incredible things. The key players in NLP like tokenization, stemming and part of speech tagging help computers process and understand language better. NLP even knows how to clean and prep text data for analysis. But here where it gets even cooler NLP has some rock star models like GPT generative pre-trained transformer that take language understanding to a whole new level these models make computers talk and understand language like never before is not that amazing so buckle up we are ready for more tech adventures let's move on the next exciting topic fuzzy logic fuzzy logic is a mathematical framework that deals with reasoning that is approximate rather than precise it extends classical crisp set theory to handle uncertainty and imprecision fuzzy logic is particularly useful in situations where traditional binary true false logic may not be adequate to model complex ambiguous or uncertain systems role and importance handling uncertainty fuzzy logic is well suited for dealing with uncertainty and imprecision in decision making processes linguistic variables allows the representation of linguistic variables and concepts such as high low hot or cold which are inherently fuzzy control systems applied in control systems especially when the rules governing the system are not well defined or when precise mathematical models are hard to obtain expert systems used in expert systems to capture and utilize human expertise that may be expressed in imprecise terms pattern recognition fuzzy logic is employed in pattern recognition and classification tasks where the boundaries between classes are not clearly defined artificial intelligence applied in artificial intelligence to model human like decision making processes that involve uncertainty learning fuzzy logic fuzzy sets understand the concept of fuzzy sets 
which allow elements to have degrees of membership between 0 and 1, representing the extent to which an element belongs to a set. Membership functions. Learn about membership functions that define the degree of membership of an element in a fuzzy set. Fuzzy operations. Explore fuzzy operations such as fuzzy intersection, union and complement which extend classical set operations to fuzzy sets. Fuzzy rules. Understand how fuzzy rules are formulated typically in the form of if, then. Statements expressing relationships between fuzzy variables. Inference systems. Learn about fuzzy inference systems which use fuzzy rules and reasoning to draw conclusions in an uncertain environment. Defuzzification. Understand defuzzification methods that convert fuzzy output into a crisp value for decision making applications. Explore real world applications of fuzzy logic in areas such as control systems, decision support systems, and pattern recognition. Fuzzy logic controllers. FLC. Familiarize yourself with fuzzy logic controllers which are used in control systems to make decisions based on fuzzy rules. Fuzzy logic toolbox. If using a programming language like MATLAB, explore the fuzzy logic toolbox, a tool for designing and simulating fuzzy inference systems, hands-on projects. Apply fuzzy logic to solve problems or model systems with uncertainty. This could involve designing a fuzzy controller or implementing a fuzzy decision making system. Stay updated. Fuzzy logic continues to be an active area of research. Stay informed about new developments and applications. Remember, fuzzy logic provides a powerful framework for handling uncertainty and its effectiveness often depends on how well it is tailored to the specific characteristics of the problem at hand. Reinforcement learning. Reinforcement learning, RL, is a type of machine learning where an agent learns how to behave in an environment by performing actions and receiving rewards or penalties. The agent's goal is to learn the optimal strategy, policy, that maximizes its cumulative reward over time. Reinforcement learning is often used in scenarios where explicit programming of a solution is challenging and the agent must learn through trial and errors. Role and importance Autonomous systems Reinforcement learning is crucial for developing autonomous systems that can learn from experience and make decisions in complex and dynamic environments. Game playing. Applied in game playing scenarios where agents can learn strategies by playing games against themselves or opponents. Robotics. Used in robotics for training robots to perform tasks such as grasping objects, navigating environments and interacting with the surroundings. Recommendation systems. Reinforcement learning can be applied in recommendation systems to learn user preferences and suggest personalized content. Finance. Applied in finance for algorithmic trading where agents learn optimal trading strategies based on market conditions. Healthcare. Used for personalized treatment planning, drug discovery and optimizing patient care strategies. Learning Reinforcement Learning Markov Decision Processes MDPS Understand the fundamentals of Markov Decision Processes which provide a mathematical framework for modeling reinforcement learning problems, states, actions and rewards. Learn about the components of reinforcement learning including states, actions and rewards and how they are used in defining the agent's interactions with the environment. Policy and value functions. Understand the concepts of policy, 
which defines the agent's strategy and value functions, which estimate the expected cumulative reward. Exploration and Exploitation Explore the trade-off between exploration, trying new actions, and exploitation, choosing actions that are known to yield high rewards. Q-Learning Learn about Q-Learning, a model-free RL algorithm that learns a quality function for actions in a given state. Deep Reinforcement Learning Explore deep reinforcement learning where deep neural networks are used to approximate value functions or policies, allowing RL to handle complex, high-dimensional state spaces. Policy Gradient Methods Understand policy gradient methods which directly optimize the policy to maximize expected rewards. Temporal Difference TD Learning Learn about temporal difference methods which update value estimates based on the difference between predicted and observed rewards. Actor critic architectures. Familiarize yourself with actor critic architectures combining aspects of both value based and policy based methods. OpenAI Gym. If using Python, Experiment with OpenAI Gym, a toolkit for developing and comparing RL algorithms in various environments. Deep Reinforcement Learning Libraries Familiarize yourself with popular deep reinforcement learning libraries like TensorFlow, PyTorch, and Stable Baselines 3. Hands-on projects Apply your knowledge by working on reinforcement learning projects. Start with simple environments and progressively move to more complex tasks. Stay updated. Reinforcement learning is an active area of research with frequent advancements. Stay informed about new algorithms and approaches. Remember, reinforcement learning involves a balance of exploration and exploitation. And practical experience through experimentation is essential for mastering it. Decision trees. Decision trees are a popular machine learning algorithm used for both classification and regression tasks. They are part of the supervised learning family and are particularly useful for decision making processes where a series of choices lead to a final outcome. Role and importance. Interpretability. Decision trees are inherently interpretable, making them useful for understanding and explaining the decision-making process. Classification Used for classification tasks, where the goal is to assign an input to one of several predefined classes. Regression Applied in regression tasks to predict a continuous output based on input features. Feature importance Decision trees provide a measure of feature importance, helping identify the most influential features in the decision-making process. Ensemble Methods Decision trees serve as building blocks for ensemble methods like random forests and gradient boosted trees, which often improve predictive performance. Learning Decision Trees Tree Structure Understand the structure of a decision tree consisting of nodes, branches, and leaves. Entropy and information gain. Learn the concepts of entropy and information gain, which are used to determine the best attribute for splitting the data at each node. Guinea impurity. Understand Guinea impurity, an alternative criterion for measuring impurity in a set of classes. Decision tree algorithms. Explore popular decision tree algorithms such as ID3, C4.5, CART, classification and regression trees, and the Guinea-based decision trees. Recursive partitioning. Learn how decision trees recursively partition the feature space based on the selected attributes. Pruning. Understand the concept of pruning 
to prevent overfitting where unnecessary branches of the tree are removed. Categorical and numerical features. Learn how decision trees handle both categorical and numerical features. Handling missing values. Explore methods for handling missing values in decision trees. Random forest. Understand random forest and ensemble method that builds multiple decision trees and combines their predictions for improved accuracy. Gradient boosted trees. Familiarize yourself with gradient boosted trees and other ensemble method that builds decision trees sequentially with each tree correcting the errors of the previous ones. Feature importance. Learn how decision trees measure feature importance based on the information gain or guinea impurity reduction. Decision tree libraries. If using Python, work with decision tree libraries such as Scikit, Learn, XGBoost, or Lite GBM. Hands on projects. Apply decision trees to real world datasets for classification or regression tasks. Experiment with hyperparameter tuning and evaluate model performance. Visualization. Visualize decision trees to gain insights into their decision making process. Tools like GraphWiz can be helpful for this. Stay updated. Decision tree algorithms and their implementations are continuously evolving. Stay informed about new developments and improvements. Support Vector Machines Support Vector Machines is a powerful and versatile machine learning algorithm used for classification and regression tasks. Support Vector Machine aims to find a hyperplane that best separates data points of different classes or predicts a continuous outcome with a clear margin between the classes. Role and Importance Effective in high dimensional spaces SVM performs well in high dimensional spaces, making it suitable for tasks with many features. Kernel trick. SVM can use the kernel trick to transform the input data into a high dimensional space, making it possible to find a hyperplane that separates non-linearly separable data. Sensitivity to outliers. SVM is less sensitive to outliers compared to some other algorithms as it focuses on the support vectors that determine the decision boundary, classification and regression. Used for both classification and regression tasks, maximum margin classifier. SVM seeks to find the hyperplane with the maximum margin between classes promoting better generalization to unseen data. Learning support vector machines, linear SVM. Understand the concept of a hyperplane and how a linear SVM separates data points in a binary classification task. Support vectors. Learn about support vectors which are the data points that lie closest to the decision boundary. Margin and slack variables. Understand the margin as the distance between the decision boundary and the support vectors and the role of slack variables in handling misclassifications. Soft margin SVM. Explore soft margin SVM which allows for some misclassifications to handle situations where the data is not perfectly separable. Kernel functions. Learn about kernel functions that is linear polynomial radial basis function and how they enable SVM to handle non-linear decision boundaries. C and gamma parameters. Understand the importance of the regularization parameter C and the kernel parameter gamma in SVM. Multi-class SVM. Explore techniques for extending SVM to handle multi-class classification tasks. Regression with SVM. Understand how SVM can be applied to regression tasks by 
predicting our continuous output SVM libraries work with popular machine learning libraries that provide SVM implementations such as scikit learning python grid search and cross validation use grid search and cross validation techniques to fine tune SVM hyperparameters for optimal performance hyperparameter tuning understand the impact of hyperparameters like c gamma and the choice of kernel on SVM performance hands on projects apply SVM to real world data sets for classification or regression tasks experiment with different kernels and hyperparameter settings visualization visualize decision boundaries and support vectors to gain insights into how SVM makes decisions Stay updated. SVM is a well-established algorithm, but improvements and variations continue to be developed. Stay informed about new research and advancements. Support vector machines are a versatile and effective tool in the machine learning toolbox, offering robust performance in various scenarios. Clustering. Clustering is a type of unsupervised machine learning where the goal is to group similar data points together based on certain characteristics or features. The objective is to discover inherent patterns or structures in the data without any predefined labels. Role and importance. Pattern discovery. Clustering helps discover hidden patterns, structures or groups within data sets. Data exploration useful for exploratory data analysis to understand the natural grouping present in the data. Anomaly detection can be used for detecting anomalies or outliers in the data by identifying data points that do not belong to any cluster. Customer segmentation commonly used in marketing for customer segmentation grouping customers with similar preferences or behaviors. Image segmentation applied in computer VN for segmenting images into regions with similar characteristics. Document clustering used in natural language processing for organizing and categorizing documents based on their content. Learning clustering K means clustering Understand the k-means algorithm which partitions data into k clusters based on the mean values of data points. Hierarchical clustering. Learn about hier hierarchical clustering, a method that builds a hierarchy of clusters either from the bottom-up, agglomerative or top-down, divisive. Density-based clustering. DBSCAN. Explore DBSCAN density based special clustering of applications with noise which groups together data points that are close to each other and marks outliers as noise gaussian mixture models gmm understand gaussian mixture models which assume that the data is generated by a mixture of several gaussian distributions evaluation matrix familiarize yourself with evaluation matrix for clustering such as silhouette score and davies bolding index to assess the quality of clusters number of clusters learn about methods for determining the optimal number of clusters such as the albo method or silhouette analysis feature scaling understand the importance of feature scaling in clustering algorithms to ensure that all features contribute equally to the similarity measurement. Dimensionality reduction. Explore the use of dimensionality reduction techniques like PCA, principal component analysis, before clustering to improve performance. Handling categorical data. Learn how to handle categorical data in clustering algorithms such as converting categorical features into numerical representations. Silhouette analysis use silhouette analysis to assess the quality of clusters and identify cases where data points may have been assigned to the wrong cluster applications explore real world applications of clustering in various domains 
such as marketing, healthcare and image processing. Clustering libraries. Work with clustering libraries in programming languages like Scikit, Learn in Python or K-Means in MATLAB. Hands-on projects. Apply clustering to real-world datasets and analyze the results. Experiment with different clustering algorithms and parameter settings. Stay updated. Clustering techniques and algorithms continue to evolve. Stay informed about new developments and improvements. Clustering is a versatile technique with various applications and the choice of algorithm depends on the nature of the data and the specific goals of the analysis. Hello viewers, today let's explore the roadmap of artificial intelligence. In our previous videos, we delved into machine learning, neural networks, deep learning and NLP. Now we have decided to conclude each video with a summary of multiple topics. In this episode, we will unravel fuzzy logic, reinforcement learning, decision tree, sport vector machine and clustering, providing a comprehensive view of AI's diverse landscape. Fuzzy logic. Fuzzy logic allows systems to handle uncertainty and imprecise information. It's applied in control systems and decision making processes where traditional binary logic may fall short. Reinforcement learning. Reinforcement learning is a type of machine learning where an agent learns by interacting with its environment. APIs in this category provide tools for building systems that can learn from trial and error. Decision tree. Decision tree are used for classification and regression tasks. The API facilitates the creation and utilization of decision trees which break down a decision making process into a tree like model. Support vector machine. Support Vector Machine is a supervised learning model for classification and regression tasks. SVM APIs assist in implementing this algorithm which finds the optimal hyperplane to separate data into classes. Clustering Clustering involves grouping similar data points together. Clustering APIs support the implementation of algorithms for tasks like customer segmentation, anomaly detection and data organization. Data mining. Data mining is the process of discovering patterns, trends and insights from large data sets. It involves extracting valuable and previously unknown information from data, enabling businesses and researchers to make informed decisions. Data mining encompasses a variety of techniques and methods often drawing on aspects of machine learning, statistics and database systems. Role and importance. Knowledge discovery. Data mining facilitates the discovery of hidden patterns, relationships and trends in data that may not be apparent through traditional analysis. Business intelligence. Used in business intelligence to extract meaningful insights from large data sets, aiding decision making processes. Predictive modeling. Data mining techniques can be applied for predictive modeling, helping to forecast future trends and outcomes. Fraud detection. Applied in finance and e-commerce for detecting fraudulent activities by analyzing patterns and anomalies in transaction data. Healthcare analytics. Utilized in healthcare for analyzing patient data, identifying disease trends, and improving treatment outcomes. Customer segmentation, commonly used in marketing for segmenting customers based on behavior, preferences, and demographics. Text mining, applied to analyze and extract valuable information from unstructured text data, such as documents, emails, and social media. Learning data mining, data pre-processing, Understand the importance of data pre-processing, including cleaning, transformation, and handling missing values to 
prepared data for mining exploratory data analysis eda learn exploratory data analysis techniques to gain insights into data distribution relationships and potential patterns data warehousing understand the role of data warehousing in data mining where integrated and clean data is stored for analysis association rule mining explore association rule mining to discover relationships between variables often used in market basket analysis clustering apply clustering techniques to group similar data points aiding in the identification of natural structures within the data classification understand classification algorithms for predicting categorical outcomes based on historical data patterns regression analysis learn regression analysis to predict numerical outcomes by modeling the relationships between variables feature selection explore feature selection methods to identify the most relevant variables for modeling time series analysis understand time series analysis techniques for mining temporal pattern in sequential data text mining and lp familiarize yourself with text mining and natural language processing and lp techniques for extracting information from textual data evaluation matrix learn about evaluation matrix to assess the performance of data mining models such as accuracy precision recall and f1 score data mining tools work with data mining tools and software such as rapid miner nime or weka that provide a user friendly interface for building and evaluating models ethical considerations understand the ethical considerations and potential biases associated with data mining particularly in sensitive domains hands on projects apply data mining techniques to real world data sets build and evaluate models interpret results and draw meaningful conclusions stay updated data mining is a dynamic field with evolving techniques stay informed by new algorithms tools and best practices data mining is a multidisciplinary field that requires a combination of statistical mathematical and computational skills bayesian networks bayesian networks also known as bayesian belief network or bayes nets are graphical models that represent the probabilistic relationships among a set of variables they are based on bayesian probability theory and used directed acyclic graphs dags to depict the dependencies between variables bayesian networks are widely used for reasoning under uncertainty and making probabilistic inferences role and importance probabilistic modeling bayesian networks provide a way to model and represent uncertain or probabilistic relationships between variables inference and prediction used for making inferences and predictions based on available evidence or observations decision support applied in decision support systems to analyze and evaluate different decision options under uncertainty risk assessment utilized for risk assessment by modeling the uncertainties associated with various factors in a system medical diagnosis used in medical diagnosis to represent the dependencies between symptoms and diseases considering uncertainty in diagnostic information speech recognition applied in natural language processing and speech recognition systems to model relationships between words and language elements learning bayesian network directed acyclic graphs dags understand the basics of directed acyclic graphs and their representation of dependencies between variables nodes and edges learn how nodes in a bayesian network represent variables and edges represent probabilistic dependencies between variables conditional probability tables cpts 
understand conditional probability tables which specify the probability distributions for each variable given its parents in the graph. Bayesian rule. Familiarize yourself with the Bayesian rule which forms the basis for updating probabilities based on new evidence. Parameter learning. Learn about methods of learning the parameters of a Bayesian network from data. Structure learning. Explore techniques for learning the structure of a Bayesian network including constraint-based, score-based and hybrid methods. Markov Blanket Understand the concept of the Markov Blanket, a set of variables that renders a variable conditionally independent of all other variables in the network. Inference Algorithms Learn about inference algorithms such as variable elimination and belief propagation used for making probabilistic inferences in Bayesian networks. Dynamic Bayesian networks DBNS Explore dynamic Bayesian networks which extend Bayesian networks to model temporal dependencies. Bayesian network tools Work with Bayesian network tools and libraries such as the Bayesian Network Toolbox in MATLAB or libraries like PGMPY in Python. Applications Explore real-world applications of Bayesian network in different domains such as finance, healthcare, and environmental modeling. Decision Analysis Understand how Bayesian networks can be used for decision analysis and decision support. Hands-on projects. Apply Bayesian network to real-world problems. Build, evaluate, and interpret Bayesian networks using relevant datasets. Stay updated. Bayesian networks and probabilistic graphical models are active research areas. Stay informed about new developments and advancements. Learning Bayesian networks involves both theoretical understanding and practical application and hands-on experience is valuable in gaining proficiency. Evolutionary Algorithms Evolutionary Algorithms EAS, are a family of optimization algorithms inspired by the principles of natural evolution. These algorithms are designed to search for optimal solutions or approximate solutions to complex problems by mimicking the process of natural selection. Crossover and Mutation Evolutionary algorithms are particularly useful for solving optimization problems with large solution spaces. Role and importance. Global optimization. Evolutionary algorithms are well suited for global optimization problems where the goal is to find the best solution among a vast number of possibilities. Combinatorial optimization applied to combinatorial optimization problems such as the traveling salesman problem or job scheduling parameter tuning used for tuning parameters of machine learning models including hyperparameters to improve performance. Multi-objective optimization capable of handling multi-objective optimization problems where there are multiple conflicting objectives to optimize robotics applied in robotics for tasks such as path planning robot control and design optimization genetic programming used in genetic programming to evolve computer programs that perform a specific task learning evolutionary algorithms initialization understand the initialization process where an initial population of potential solutions is generated randomly or using heuristics. Selection. Learn about selection mechanisms that determine which individuals in the population are chosen to be parents for the next generation based on their fitness. Crossover. Recombination. Understand the crossover operator where genetic information from two parent solutions is combined to create new offspring solutions. Mutation. Learn about the mutation operator which introduces small random changes in the genetic information of individual solutions. Termination criteria. Understand termination criteria which determine when the algorithm should stop evolving the population, that is, after a certain number of generations or when a satisfactory solution is found. Fitness function. 
learn about the fitness function which evaluates how well a solution performs the task at hand and guides the evaluation process. Genetic Algorithms GAS Explore genetic algorithms, a specific type of evolutionary algorithm that uses genetic operators inspired by natural selection. Differential Evaluation DE. Understand differential evaluation, an evaluationary algorithm that uses the difference between individuals in the population to generate new candidate solutions. Particle Swarm Optimization PSO. Familiarize yourself with particle swarm optimization, another optimization technique inspired by the social behavior of birds and fish, evolution strategies, ES. Learn about evolution strategies and optimization algorithm that uses random variations in the population to find better solutions. Meta heuristics. Understand the concept of meta heuristics of which evolutionary algorithms are a subset and how they differ from classical optimization techniques. Parallel and distributed evolutionary algorithms. Explore techniques for parallelizing and distributing evolutionary algorithms to handle computationally in intensive tasks. Parameter tuning. Apply Evolutionary algorithms for parameter tuning in machine learning models such as adjusting hyperparameters for improved performance. Evolutionary algorithm libraries. Familiarize yourself with evolutionary algorithm libraries in programming languages like Python such as Deep, Distribution Evolutionary Algorithm in Python or the Genetic Algorithm Library GALIB. Hands-on projects. Apply evolutionary algorithms to solve optimization problems. Experiment with different operators, population sizes, and termination criteria. Stay updated. Evolutionary algorithms and optimization techniques are areas of ongoing research. Stay informed about the latest development and applications. Practical exper experience and experimentation with different settings are crucial in mastering evolutionary algorithms. Pattern recognition. Pattern recognition is a field of study that involves the identification of patterns or regularities in data, allowing systems to recognize and interpret information. It spans various domains including computer vision, speech recognition, signal processing, and machine learning. The goal is to develop algorithms and systems that can automatically discover and classify patterns within data. Role and importance, computer vision, used in computer vision to identify objects, faces and patterns within images or videos. Pattern recognition, speech recognition. Applied speech recognition systems to identify spoken words and patterns in audio signals. Biometrics utilized in biometric systems for recognizing unique patterns in human characteristics such as fingerprints or IRES scans. Medical imaging applied in medical imaging for the analysis and interpretation of images including the detection of anomalies and diseases. Natural language processing used in NLP for extracting patterns and meaning from text data enabling tasks like sentiment analysis and named entity recognition. Remote sensing applied remote sensing for the interpretation of data from satellites or sensors such as identifying land cover types, manufacturing and quality control utilized in manufacturing for quality control and identifying defects in products. Feature extraction. Understand the process of feature extraction where relevant information is extracted from raw data to represent patterns. Supervised versus unsupervised learning. Differentiate between supervised learning learning from labeled data and unsupervised learning finding patterns without labeled data. Classifiers learn about different classifiers used in pattern recognition such as k-nearest neighbors, support vector machines 
एंड न्यूरल नेटवर्क डायमेंशनैलिटी रिडक्शन अंडरस्टैंड डायमेंशनैलिटी रिडक्शन टेक्निक्स सच एज प्रिंसिपल कंपोनेंट एनालिसिस पी सी ए फॉर रिड्यूसिंग द नंबर ऑफ फीचर्स वाइल प्रिजर्विंग इंपॉर्टेंट इंफॉर्मेशन क्लस्टरिंग एक्सप्लोर क्लस्टरिंग एल्गोरिदम्स फॉर अनसुपरवाइज पैटर्न डिस्कवरी सच एज के मीन्स और हरारिकल क्लस्टरिंग डीप लर्निंग फेमिलराइज योर सेल्फ विद डीप लर्निंग टेक्निक्स एस्पेशली कॉन्वोल्यूशनल न्यूरल नेटवर्क सी एन एन एस फॉर इमेज बेस्ड पैटर्न रिकग्नेशन एंड रेकोरेंट न्यूरल नेटवर्क आर एन एन एस फॉर सिक्वेंशियल डेटा स्टेटिस्टिकल मैथड्स लर्न अबाउट स्टेटिस्टिकल मैथड्स यूज इन पैटर्न रिकग्नेशन सच एज बेजियन क्लासीफायर्स और हिडन मार्कोव मॉडल्स कर्नल मैथड्स एक्सप्लोर कर्नल मैथड्स such as the kernel trick in support vector machines for transforming data into higher dimensional spaces ensemble methods understand ensemble methods like random forests which combine multiple classifiers for improved performance evaluation metrics familiarize yourself with evolution metrics including accuracy persian recall and f1 score for assessing the performance of pattern recognition systems transfer learning explore transfer learning techniques where knowledge gained from one task is applied to a different but related task pattern recognition tools work with pattern recognition libraries and tools such as scikit learn in python matlab's image processing toolbox or deep learning frameworks like TensorFlow or PyTorch hands-on projects apply pattern recognition techniques to real world data sets build train and evaluate models for specific tasks stay updated pattern recognition is a dynamic field with ongoing advancements especially in the areas of deep learning and and interdisciplinary applications stay informed about new research and developments Pattern recognition involves a combination of the theoretical understanding, algorithm implementation and practical application. Computer vision. Computer vision is a field of artificial intelligence that enables machines to interpret and make decisions based on visual data. The goal is to teach computers to understand and interpret the visual world in a way similar to how humans do. Role and importance: image recognition. Computer vision is used for image recognition tasks where machines can identify and classify objects within images. Object detection. This involves not only recognizing objects in an image but also locating and drawing bounding boxes around them image segmentation computer vision can segment an image into meaningful parts assigning different labels to different regions facial recognition it is applied in recognizing and identifying faces often used in security systems authentication processes and social media tagging gesture recognition computer vision can interpret human gestures which is useful in applications like virtual reality gaming and human computer interaction visual slam simultaneous localization and mapping used in robotics visual slam enables machines to navigate and understand their environment using visual input medical image analysis Computer vision plays a crucial role in analyzing medical images such as x-rays, MRIs and CT scans for diagnosis and treatment planning. Autonomous vehicles. Computer vision is integral to the development of autonomous vehicles enabling them to perceive and navigate the environment. Learning computer vision. 
बेसिक्स ऑफ इमेज प्रोसेसिंग अंडरस्टैंड द बेसिक्स ऑफ इमेज प्रोसेसिंग इंक्लूडिंग ऑपरेशन लाइक ब्लरिंग शार्पनिंग एंड एज डिटेक्शन इमेज रिप्रेजेंटेशन लर्न हाउ इमेजेस आर रिप्रेजेंटेड इन कंप्यूटर्स इंक्लूडिंग कलर स्पेसिस एंड पिक्सल वैल्यूज इमेज फिल्टरिंग एंड कन्वोल्यूशन अंडरस्टैंड कन्वोल्यूशनल ऑपरेशन एंड फिल्टर्स विच आर फंडामेंटल टू मैनी कंप्यूटर वी एन टास्क फीचर एक्सट्रैक्शन एक्सप्लोर फीचर एक्सट्रैक्शन टेक्निक्स टू कैप्चर इंपॉर्टेंट इंफॉर्मेशन फ्रॉम इमेज इमेज क्लासिफिकेशन लर्न अबाउट इमेज क्लासिफिकेशन यूजिंग मशीन लर्निंग एंड डीप लर्निंग मॉडल्स कन्वोल्यूशनल न्यूरल नेटवर्कस सी एन एन एस आर कॉमनली यूज फॉर दिस टास्क ऑब्जेक्ट डिटेक्शन अंडरस्टैंड ऑब्जेक्ट डिटेक्शन एल्गोरिदम्स सच एज सिंगल शॉट मल्टी बॉक्स डिटेक्टर एस एस डी एंड यू ओनली लुक वंस वाई ओ एल ओ इमेज सेगमेंटेशन एक्सप्लोर इमेज सेगमेंटेशन टेक्निक्स विच इन्वॉल्व डिवाइडिंग एन इमेज इन टू सेगमेंट्स और रीजन्स ट्रांसफर लर्निंग लर्न हाउ टू यूज प्री ट्रेन मॉडल्स फॉर ट्रांसफर लर्निंग इन कंप्यूटर वी एन टास्क फ्रेमवर्कस एंड लाइब्रेरीज फेमिलियराइज योर सेल्फ विद पॉपुलर कंप्यूटर वी एन लाइब्रेरीज एंड फ्रेमवर्क लाइक ओपन सी वी टेंसर फ्लो एंड पाई टॉर्च थ्री डी कंप्यूटर वी एन इफ इंटरेस्टेड एक्सप्लोर द फील्ड ऑफ थ्री डी कंप्यूटर वी एन विच डील्स विद द रिकंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ थ्री डायमेंशनल ऑब्जेक्ट्स फ्रॉम विजुअल डेटा हैंड्स ऑन प्रोजेक्ट्स अप्लाई योर नॉलेज थ्रू हैंड्स ऑन प्रोजेक्ट्स दिस कुड इन्वॉल्व बिल्डिंग एन इमेज क्लासीफायर ऑब्जेक्ट डिटेक्शन सिस्टम और एक्सप्लोरिंग अ स्पेसिफिक कंप्यूटर वी एन एप्लीकेशन स्टे अपडेटेड कंप्यूटर वी एन इज अ डायनेमिक फील्ड विद ऑन गोइंग रिसर्च एंड एडवांसमेंट्स स्टे अपडेटेड विद द लेटेस्ट लिटरेचर एंड डिवेलपमेंट्स वंस अगेन हेलो व्यूअर्स Building on this foundation we move to image classification using powerful tools like convolutional neural network CNNs this tech allows machines to not only recognize but also locate and classify objects in images imagine your machine understanding gestures identifying faces and making sense of complex visual data it's all part of the magic of computer vision and the key to making this magic happen understanding image representation filters and convolutional these are the essential ingredients dive into object detection to draw boxes around recognized objects and image segmentation to break down images into meaningful parts don't forget your tech companies open cv tensor flow and pytorch these frameworks will be your guides as you embark on hands on projects from building image classifiers to exploring specific applications of computer vision remember the world of computer vision is dynamic with ongoing research and discoveries stay curious stay updated and let's explore the endless possibilities of seeing the world through the eyes of machine expert systems an expert system is a type of artificial intelligence that emulates the decision making ability of a human expert in a specific domain it's designed to solve complex problems by reasoning through knowledge and providing advice or making decisions based on that knowledge role and importance knowledge representation expert systems are built upon a knowledge base which stores information and expertise in a particular domain this knowledge is represented in a structured format problem solving expert systems are capable of solving complex problems within a specific domain by applying their knowledge base and reasoning mechanisms decision support they provide decision support by offering recommendations or solutions based on the rules and knowledge embedded in the system 
Consistency Expert systems ensure consistency in decision making as they apply predefined rules consistently and do not suffer from human biases. Training and education Expert systems can be used for training and education purposes, helping users understand and learn about a specific domain. Automation In some cases, expert systems can automate decision making processes, reducing the need for human intervention in routine or rule based tasks. Learning expert systems Understand knowledge representation. Learn about knowledge representation methods including rules, facts and inference mechanisms. Domain knowledge. Understand the specific domain for which you want to build an expert system. This involves acquiring or having access to expert knowledge in that domain. Rule based systems. Explore rule based systems which form the backbone of many expert systems. These rules encode the knowledge and logic of the domain. Inference engines. Learn about inference engines which are responsible for drawing conclusions or making decisions based on the rules and facts in the knowledge base. Knowledge acquisition. Understand the process of knowledge acquisition which involves gathering, organizing and encoding the knowledge of experts into the system. Expert system shells. Familiarize yourself with expert system development tools or shells that provide a framework for building expert systems. Certainty factors and uncertainty. Explore how expert systems handle uncertainty and make decisions in situations where information may be incomplete or uncertain. Practical implementation. Apply your knowledge by working on small scale expert system project. This could involve solving a specific problem within a domain of interest. Evaluation and refinement. Evaluation the performance of your expert system and refine it based on feedback and real-world testing. Stay updated. While the basic principles of expert systems remain consistent, stay updated with advancements in artificial intelligence and knowledge representation techniques. An expert system is smart computer system that helps make decisions like a human expert in a particular area. It's good at solving complex problems and giving advice. This system is important because it keeps information in a structured way, making it easy to understand. It helps solve tricky problems, gives suggestions based on its knowledge and ensures decisions are consistent. You can learn to build one by understanding how information is stored. Knowing about the specific area it works in and using rules to make decisions. It's like teaching the computer to think and decide like an expert. Learning about it involves practical projects and staying updated with new ideas in this smart computer field. Robotics is an interdisciplinary field that involves the design, construction, operation and use of robots. A robot is a machine that can be programmed to carry out tasks autonomously or semi-autonomously. Robotics combines principles from computer science, mechanical engineering, electrical engineering and other fields to create intelligent machines capable of interacting with the physical world. Role and Importance Automation Robotics enables the automation of various tasks ranging from simple and repetitive actions to complex and sophisticated operations. Manufacturing Industrial robots play a crucial role in manufacturing processes, performing tasks like assembly, welding, painting and quality control. Healthcare Robots are used in healthcare for tasks such as surgery, 
patient care and rehabilitation. They can perform precise and delicate procedures under the guidance of human operators. Exploration Robots are deployed in exploration missions both in space and on Earth. They can go to places that are hazardous or challenging for humans such as deep sea exploration or space missions. Autonomous Vehicles Robotics is fundamental in the development of autonomous vehicles including self-driving cars and drones. Education and Research Robotics is used as a tool for education and research, allowing students and researchers to experiment with and understand principles of mechanics, electronics and programming. Assistive Devices Robots are designed to assist individuals with disabilities, providing support for daily activities and improving the quality of life. Learning Robotics Understand the basics of robotics. Learn about the fundamental principles of robotics, including kinematics, dynamics, and control systems. Mechanical Engineering Fundamentals Gain knowledge in mechanical engineering as it is crucial for designing the physical structure and components of robots. Electrical and Electronics Engineering Understand the basics of electrical and electronics engineering as robotics often involves sensors, actuators and electronic control system. Programming Learn programming languages commonly used in robotics such as Python, C++ or specialized language like ROS Robot Operating System for robot control. Sensor Integration Explore sensors used in robotics including cameras, lidar, ultrasonic sensors and more. Understand how these sensors provide information for robot perception. Actuator Control Learn about actuators like motors and servos and how to control them to achieve desired movement and actions. Kinematics and Dynamics Understand the kinematics study of motion and dynamics study of forces of robots. This is crucial for designing and controlling robot movements. Robot Operating System ROS Familiarize yourself with ROS, an open source framework for writing robot software. It provides tools and libraries for robot software development. Simulations Use robotic simulations to experiment with and test your robot designs and algorithms in a virtual environment before implementing them on a physical robot. Hands-on projects Apply your knowledge through hands-on projects. This could involve building a simple robot, programming its movements, or integrating sensors for specific tasks, collaborative and swarm, Robotics. Explore collaborative and swarm robotics where multiple robots work together to achieve a common goal. Stay updated. Stay informed about the latest developments and research in robotics. This field is evolving rapidly with new technologies and applications emerging regularly. Hello viewers. Once again, explaining a topic, robots. So robotics is about making robots, machines that can do things on their own. Here is why it's cool. Easy jobs. Robots help with work, making it easier for us. Making stuff. In big factories, in big plants, robots put things together and make sure they are good. Healthcare friends. Robots help doctors and take care of sick people. Adventure Robots Some robots explore places where it's hard for people to go, like deep underwater or in space. Smart Cars and Drones Robots help cars drive themselves and drones fly without people staring. Learning Fun People use robots to learn cool things about how stuff works. 
helping people. Some robots are made to help those who need extra support. To get into robotics, start by learning how robots move and are built, know a bit about machines and electricity. Learn to talk robots using computer languages like Python or C++. It's like teaching them to speak robot language. Have fun making your own little robot buddies. Hope I made it easy to understand. Thanks. Knowledge representation. Knowledge representation is a fundamental concept in artificial intelligence that involves structuring information in a way that a computer system can utilize to solve complex problems, make decisions, or generate intelligent behavior. It's about capturing and organizing knowledge in a form that is suitable for computational reasoning. Role and importance facilitates reasoning. Knowledge representation provides a framework for computers to perform reasoning and draw inferences based on the information stored. Problem solving, it is essential for solving problems by allowing systems to manipulate and process information relevant to a particular domain. Decision making enables intelligent systems to make decisions by representing and processing knowledge about the problem domain. Learning Sports machine learning algorithms by providing a structure for organizing and storing learned information. Communication facilitates communication between different components of an intelligent system and allows sharing of information in a structured format. Interoperability helps in integrating information from various sources and systems, promoting interoperability. Natural language processing. Knowledge representation is crucial in NLP for understanding and processing human language by mapping linguistic expressions to underlying concepts. Learning knowledge representation ontologies. Understand ontologies which are formal representations of a set of concepts within a domain and the relationships between those concepts. Frames. Learn about frames, a knowledge representation technique that organizes information in a structure similar to a template, where properties and values are associated with objects. Semantic networks. Explore semantic networks, graphical structures, representing relationships between concepts. Logic-based representation. Understand logic-based representations including pro propositional logic and first order logic which provide a formal and declarative way to express knowledge rule based systems learn about rule based systems where knowledge is represented in the form of rules that govern actions or inferences knowledge graphs familiarize yourself with knowledge graphs which represent information as nodes and edges connecting entities in a graph structure. Description logics. Explore description logics, a family of formalisms for knowledge representation, often used in ontology languages. Graph databases. Understand graph databases which are effective for storing and querying knowledge graphs. Protege and OWL. Use tools like Protege and languages like Web Ontology Language OWL for creating and managing ontologies. Practical implementation. Apply knowledge representation in practical scenarios. This could involve creating an ontology, defining rules or building a knowledge graph. Stay updated. Knowledge representation is an evolving field. Stay updated with new research standards and tools related to knowledge representation. So viewers, once again, I am here to summarize last topic, trying to make it easy as much as possible. Imagine teaching computers to think and make smart choices. That's knowledge representation in a nutshell. It helps computers solve problems, learn and even understand human language. Why is it cool? 
smart decisions computers use it to make clever choices based on what they know problem solving pro key to cracking tough problems by processing specific input learning buddy great for machine learning organizing what computers learn smooth communication helps computer parts talk and share information in an organized way team player gathers information from different places making them work together language whiz vital for computers to get human language to get into it learn about ontologies frames and logic based systems it's like teaching computers their language use tools like protege and ol keep an eye on what's new to stay sharp speech recognition speech recognition also known as automatic speech recognition asr is a technology that converts spoken language into written text it involves the use of algorithms and models to analyze audio signals identify spoken words and transcribe them into written form role and importance hands free interaction enables hands free interaction with devices making it convenient for users to control and interact with technology using their voices accessibility provides accessibility for individuals with disabilities by allowing them to use voice commands instead of traditional input methods virtual assistants power virtual assistants and voice activated systems like siri google assistant and alexa allowing users to perform tasks through voice commands transcription services used in transcription services to convert spoken words in audio or video rec- recordings into written text voice search enables voice search functionality on search engines and other platforms making it easier for users to find information feature extraction understand feature extraction techniques used in speech processing such as mel frequency capstrol coefficient mfccs to represent speech signals acoustic models explore acoustic models which are statistical models that represent the relationship between audio features and phonemes or subword units language models understand language models which capture the probability of word sequences and help in predicting the most likely word given the context hidden markov models hmms learn about hidden markov models a common framework used in speech recognition to model the temporal sequence of speech neural networks for asr explore the use of neural networks particularly recurrent neural networks rnns and long short term memory networks lstms in modern speech recognition systems hands on projects apply your knowledge through hands on projects start with simple tasks like building a basic speech recognizer and progressively work on more complex projects real time applications explore real time applications of speech recognition such as building a voice controlled application or integrating speech recognition into a larger system stay updated Speech recognition technology is evolving with ongoing research and improvements. Stay informed about the latest development in the field. Genetic algorithms, genetic algorithms (GAS) are optimization algorithms inspired by the process of natural selection and evolution. They are part of the broader class of evolutionary algorithms and are used for searching, optimization and machine learning tasks. The key idea behind genetic algorithms is to evolve a population of potential solutions to a problem over successive generations. Role and importance optimization. Genetic algorithms are effective for optimization problems where the goal is to find the best solution among a large set of possibilities. Search 
heuristics provide a search heuristics that mimics the process of natural selection making them suitable for problems with a large solution space exploration and exploitation balance exploration and exploitation by maintaining a diverse population and gradually converging towards better solutions complex and non linear problems well suited for complex and non linear optimization problems where traditional optimization methods may struggle global search genetic algorithms are often capable of finding global optima avoiding getting stuck in local optima parameter optimization used for tuning parameters of machine learning models and algorithms learning genetic algorithms representation of solutions understand how potential solutions to a problem are represented as individuals in a population typically in the form of chromosome or genomes initialization learn about the initialization process where an initial population of potential solutions is generated randomly or using heuristics crossover recombination understand the crossover operator where genetic information from two parent solutions is combined to create new offspring solutions mutation learn about the mutation operator which introduces small random changes in the genetic information of individual solutions selection explore selection mechanisms that determine which individuals in the population are chosen to be parents for the next generation based on their fitness fitness function understand the role of the fitness function which evaluates how well a solution performs the task at hand and guides the evolution process termination criteria learn about termination criteria which determine when the algorithm should stop evolving the population that is after a certain number of generations or when a satisfactory solution is found crossover and mutation rates experiment with the tuning of crossover and mutation rates which influence the exploration and exploitation balance parameter tuning apply genetic algorithms for parameter tuning in machine learning models such as adjusting hyperparameters for improved performance library usage familiarize yourself with genetic algorithm libraries in programming languages like python such as deep distributed evaluationary algorithms in python or the genetic algorithm library galib hands on projects apply genetic algorithms to solve optimization problems this could involve solving a classic optimization problem or applying genetic algorithms to a specific domain stay updated genetic algorithms and evolutionary computation are active research areas stay updated with the latest research papers and advancements swarm intelligence swarm intelligence is a collective behavior observed in natural systems where individuals often simple agents interact with each other and their environment to achieve complex and adaptive behavior inspired by the collective behavior of social insects birds and other organisms swarm intelligence is applied in the field of artificial intelligence to solve complex problems through decentralized self organized systems role and importance optimization swarm intelligence is used for solving optimization problems where a group of agents collaboratively searches for the optimal solution in a large search space routing and scheduling applied in network routing and task scheduling to find efficient paths or schedules for data vehicles or tasks robotics utilized in robotics for swarm robotics where a group of simple robots collaboratively achieves tasks such as exploration search and rescue or environmental monitoring and colony optimization aco a popular swarm intelligence algorithm inspired by the foraging behavior of ants used for solving combinatorial optimization problems
Practical Swarm Optimization (PSO) and other widely used swarm intelligence algorithm inspired by the social behavior of birds and fish applied for optimization tasks. Adaptive Systems Swarm intelligence is employed in adaptive systems where collective behavior emerges from the interactions of individual agents without centralized control. Agent-based systems Understand the concept of agent-based systems where individual agents interact with each other and their environment. Emergence Learn about emergence, the phenomenon where complex and adaptive behavior arises from the interaction of simple agents. Self-organization Understand self-organization, the ability of a system to organize itself without external control often seen in swarm intelligence systems. Optimization algorithms Study optimization algorithms inspired by swarm intelligence including ant colony optimization ACO, particle swarm optimization PSO and B algorithm. Communication and interaction. Explore communication and interaction mechanisms among agents in swarm intelligence systems such as pheromone trails in ACO or velocity updates in PSO. Collaboration versus competition. Understand the balance between collaboration and competition among agents in swarm intelligence systems and how it contributes to problem solving. Dynamic environments. Learn how swarm intelligence algorithms adapt to dynamic environments where conditions and objectives may change over time. Collaboration versus competition. Understand the balance between collaboration and competition among agents in swarm intelligence systems and how it contributes to problem solving. Dynamic environments. Learn how swarm intelligence algorithms adapt to dynamic environments where conditions and objectives may change over time. Hybrid approaches. Explore hybrid approaches that combine swarm intelligence with other optimization or machine learning techniques for enhanced performance. Multi-objective optimization. Understand how swarm intelligence algorithms can be extended to handle multi-objective optimization problems with conflicting objectives. Applications Explore real-world applications of swarm intelligence in optimization, robotics, telecommunications, and other domains. Parameter tuning Learn about parameter tuning in swarm intelligence algorithms and how it affects the convergence and performance of the algorithms. Swarm Intelligence Libraries Work with Swarm Intelligence Libraries and Frameworks in programming languages like Python, MATLAB, or Java. Hands-on projects Apply Swarm Intelligence algorithms to real-world optimization problems, experiment with different parameters, and analyze the performance. Stay updated. Swarm Intelligence is a dynamic field with ongoing research. Stay informed about new developments and applications. Swarm Intelligence provides a fascinating perspective on problem solving inspired by nature's cooperative behaviors. Transfer Learning Transfer Learning is a machine learning paradigm where a model trained on one task is adapted or fine-tuned for a second related task. Instead of training a model from scratch for each specific task, Transfer Learning leverages knowledge gained from solving a source task to improve performance on a target task. This approach is particularly useful when the target task has limited labeled data. Data efficiency enables the transfer of knowledge from a task with abundant data to a related task with limited data, improving efficiency in training. Model generalization improves the generalization of model to new tasks by leveraging learned features from previous tasks. Domain adaptation facilitates adaptation of a model trained in one domain to perform well in different but related domain. Fine-tuning pre-trained models commonly used in computer vision and natural language processing to fine-tune pre-trained models such as convolutional neural networks CNNS for image or pre-trained language models for text. Reduced training time reduces the amount of time and computational 
resources needed for training especially for complex models source and target tasks understand the concept of source and target tasks where the source task provides knowledge to improve performance on the target task pre-trained models learn about pre-trained models which are models trained on large data sets for genetic tasks such as image classification or language modeling feature extraction understand feature extraction where lower layer of a pre-trained model act as feature extractors for new tasks fine tuning explore fine tuning the process of adjusting the parameters of a pre-trained model on a new task while retaining learned features transfer learning approaches familiarize yourself with different transfer learning approaches including feature based transfer fine tuning and model based transfer domain adaptation learn about domain adaptation a form of transfer learning that deals with differences between the source and target domains task similarity understand the importance of task similarity in transfer learning where the source and target tasks should be related for effective knowledge transfer data augmentation explore data augmentation techniques to artificially increase the size of the target data sets and improve model generalization layer freezing learn about layer freezing where certain layers of a pre-trained model are kept fixed during fine tuning hyperparameter tuning understand the role of hyperparameter tuning including learning rates and regulation in the fine tuning process applications in different domains explore how transfer learning is applied in computer vision natural language processing speech recognition and other domains evolution metrics familiarize yourself with evolution metrics specific to the target task and understand how to assess the performance improvement achieved through transfer learning transfer learning libraries work with popular machine learning libraries that support transfer learning such as tensorflow pytorch or keras hands on projects apply transfer learning to real world data sets and tasks experiment with different pre trained models and fine tuning strategies stay updated Transfer learning is an evolving field with ongoing research. Stay informed about new methods, architectures and applications. Transfer learning is a powerful technique that enhances the capabilities of machine learning models, especially in scenarios where labeled data for the target task is limited. Adversarial learning. Adversarial learning is a machine learning paradigm that involves the training of models in the presence of adversarial examples or adversaries attempting to mislead the model. The primary focus is on improving the robustness and security of machine learning models against adversarial attacks. Adversarial learning is particularly important in applications such as computer vision natural language processing and speech recognition where models are vulnerable to crafted input designed to deceive them robustness improvement adversarial learning aims to enhance the robustness of machine learning models against international attacks and perturbations security in machine learning systems addresses vulnerabilities in machine learning systems preventing them from making incorrect predictions in the presence of adversarial inputs understanding model weaknesses adversarial learning helps researchers and practitioners understand the weaknesses and vulnerabilities of machine learning models real world applications recognizes the importance of development models that perform reliably in real world scenarios where adversaries may intentionally manipulate input data adversarial examples understand what adversarial examples are input data specifically crafted to mislead a machine learning model adversarial attacks explore different types of adversarial attacks including white box 
attacks where attackers have access to the models, architecture and parameters and black box attacks where attackers do not have access to model internals. Adversarial training Learn about adversarial training, a technique where models are trained on a mix of standard and adversarial examples to improve robustness. Generative Adversarial Networks GANS. Familiarize yourself with Generative Adversarial Networks, a class of models where a generator and a discriminator are trained in tandem, often used for generating realistic data. Fast Gradient Sign Methods FGSM. Understand the Fast Gradient Sign Method, a simple yet effective method for generating adversarial examples by perturbing input data based on the model's gradients. Adversarial training libraries work with machine learning libraries that provide tools for adversarial training such as Clever Hands for TensorFlow or ART. Adversarial Robustness Toolbox for various frameworks. Transferable Adversarial Examples. Explore transferability of adversarial examples where an adversarial example designed for one model can deceive other models as well. Defense Mechanisms. Understand various defense mechanisms against adversarial attacks including adversarial training, input pre-processing and model distillation. Evasion attacks versus poisoning attacks. Differentiate between evasion attacks where adversaries manipulate input data to deceive the model and poisoning attacks where adversaries manipulate training data to compromise model performance. Model interpretability. Recognize the importance of model interpretability in understanding how models make decisions which is crucial for detecting and mitigating adversarial attacks. Adversarial robustness in different domains. Explore how adversarial learning is applied in different domains such as computer vision, natural language processing and speech recognition research paper and conferences. Stay informed about recent research papers, conferences and developments in the field of adversarial learning. Adversarial learning is an active area of research and ongoing efforts are directed toward making machine learning models more robust and secure in the face of adversarial challenges. Quantum Computing for Advanced Applications Quantum computing is a cutting-edge field that leverages the principles of quantum mechanics to perform computation in ways that classical computers cannot. While quantum computers are still in the early stage of development, they hold the potential to revolutionize various industries and solve complex problems that are currently interactable for classical computers. Here are some advanced applications of quantum computing. Quantum cryptography. Quantum computing can enhance cryptographic protocols by leveraging the principles of quantum mechanics to create secure communication channels. Quantum key distribution, QKD, is a notable application where the security of communication is guaranteed by the principles of quantum physics optimization problems. Quantum computers are well suited for solving complex optimization problems such as portfolio optimization, traffic optimization or supply chain optimization. Quantum algorithms like the quantum approximate optimization algorithm QAOA aim to find optimal solutions more efficiently than classical algorithms. Drug discovery and molecular simulation. Quantum computers have the potential to simulate complex quantum systems, making them valuable for drug discovery and molecular simulation. Understanding the behavior of molecules at the quantum level could lead to the discovery of new materials and drugs. Machine learning. Quantum machine learning algorithms such as quantum support vector machines and Quantum neural networks have been proposed to leverage the quantum nature of information for solving machine learning tasks more efficiently than classical counterparts. 
Financial modeling. Quantum computing can be applied to complex financial modeling tasks such as option pricing, risk analysis, and portfolio optimization. Quantum algorithms may offer advantages in handling large scale financial data sets, supply chain, and logistics. Quantum computing can be used to optimize supply chain and logistics operations, addressing complex problems like route optimization, inventory management, and demand forecasting. Graph theory and network analysis. Quantum computers may excel in solving graph-related problems such as finding the shortest path in a network or optimizing network structures. This can have applications in transportation planning, social network analysis, and communication networks. Climate modeling. Quantum computers can contribute to more accurate climate modeling and simulations. Their ability to handle complex quantum systems can improve our understanding of climate processes and aid in developing strategies for climate change mitigation. Artificial Intelligence and Quantum Machine Learning Quantum computing has the potential to accelerate certain AI tasks, especially those involving optimization and large-scale linear algebra. Quantum machine learning algorithms aim to provide a quantum advantage in solving specific AI-related problems. Quantum communication networks Quantum computers can play a role in the development of secure quantum communication networks, enabling quantum key distribution and quantum secure communication. Particle physics simulation Quantum computers could be used for simulating particle physics phenomena, helping researchers understand fundamental aspects of the universe at a more detailed level. Complex system simulations. Quantum computers may be valuable for simulating complex systems in various domains such as biological systems, economical models, or social systems. It's important to note that uh, quantum computing is still in its early stages and practical large-scale quantum computers are not yet widely available. Researchers and engineers are actively working on developing more robust and scalable quantum hardware and algorithms to unlock the full potential of quantum computing for advanced applications. As the field progresses, it is likely to have a transformative impact on various industries. Cognitive Computing Cognitive computing is a multidisciplinary field that aims to create systems capable of mimicking human cognition and problem-solving abilities. It involves the integration of various technologies including artificial intelligence, machine learning, natural language processing, and advanced data analytics. Cognitive computing systems are designed to understand, reason, and learn from large volumes of data in a manner that resembles human thought processes. Here are key aspects of cognitive computing. Natural language processing. Cognitive computing systems use NLP to understand and interpret human language, enabling them to interact with users in a more natural and conservational manner. Machine learning. Incorporating machine learning algorithms allows cognitive systems to learn from data and improve their performance over time. This adaptive capability enables them to handle complex tasks and make informed decisions. Pattern recognition. Cognitive computing systems excel at pattern recognition, allowing them to identify trends, anomalies, and meaningful insights within large data sets. Knowledge representation. These systems create models that represent and organize knowledge in a way that facilitates reasoning and problem solving Knowledge graphs and ontologies are often employed for effective representation. Context awareness. Cognitive computing emphasizes context awareness, enabling system to understand and respond to user input or data in a contextually relevant manner. Reasoning and inference. Cognitive systems engage in reasoning and inference Processes drawing conclusions from available information and making logical decisions. 
Adaptability Cognitive computing systems exhibit adaptability by continuously learning from new data and adjusting their behavior accordingly. This adaptability enhances their ability to handle evolving situations. Human-machine collaboration Cognitive computing is designed to foster collaboration between humans and machines, leveraging the strengths of each. These systems aim to complement human capabilities rather than replace them. Emotion recognition. Some cognitive computing systems incorporate capabilities for recognizing human emotions. This feature is particularly relevant in applications involving human computer interaction and customer engagement. Sensory perception. Integrating sensors and IoT devices allows cognitive systems to perceive and interact with the physical world extending their capabilities beyond data analysis and decision making problem solving cognitive computing systems are adept at problem solving whether it involves complex mathematical calculations optimization problems or strategic planning biologically inspired algorithms some cognitive computing approaches draw inspiration from neuroscience and biology employing algorithms that mimic certain aspects of the brain's structure and function. Ethical considerations Due to the potential impact on decision making and human interaction, cognitive computing also involves addressing ethical considerations including bias mitigation, transparency and accountability. Real world applications Cognitive computing finds applications in diverse fields including healthcare diagnostics, finance, customer service, research, and autonomous systems. Cognitive computing represents a paradigm shift in how machines interact with and support human cognition. As the field evolves, researchers and practitioners continue to explore new possibilities and refine existing technologies to enhance the capabilities of cognitive computing systems. Game theory. Game theory is a branch of mathematics and economics that studies strategic interactions among rational decision makers. It provides a framework for analyzing situations where the outcome of an individual's decision depends on not only on their actions but also on the actions of others. Game theory is widely used in various fields including economics, political science, biology, computer science, and psychology. Players, individuals or entities making decisions in a strategic interaction. Strategies, courses of action that players can choose to pursue in a game. Key concepts and components, payoffs, outcomes or rewards associated with particular combinations of strategies chosen by the players normal form and extensive form games. Normal form games represent simultaneous move games where players choose strategies without knowing the choices of others. Extensive form games on the other hand represent sequential move games where players make decision in a specific order and the game is represented as a tree. Nash equilibrium a situation in which no player has an incentive to unilaterally change their strategy, given the strategies chosen by others. Dominant strategy, a strategy that is optimal for a player regardless of the strategies chosen by other players. Zero-sum games, games in which one player's gain is exactly balanced by another player's loss. The total playoff across all players sum to zero. Cooperative games. Games where players can form coalition and negotiate to achieve joint outcomes. Repeated games. Games that are played over multiple rounds allowing for the possibility of strategies that involve cooperation, punishment or retaliation. Mixed strategies. Strategies that involve randomizing actions according to a probability distribution. Players may choose between different pure strategies with certain probabilities. Pareto efficiency, a situation in which no player can be made better off without making another player worse off. Sequential rationality, 
a concept in extensive form games where players make decisions in a way that is consistent with their interests at each decision point. Economics Game theory is extensively used in economics to analyze competition, pricing strategies, and market interactions. Political Science Applied to model strategic interactions in political campaigns, negotiations, and international relations. Biology Used to model evolutionary processes, animal behavior, and the evolution of cooperation. Computer Science Applied in algorithm design, networking protocols, and the study of multi-agent systems. Social Science Used to study human behavior, cooperation, and conflict resolution. Business and management applied to strategic decision making, negotiation strategies, and competition analysis. Environmental science used to analyze resource allocation, conservation strategies, and environmental negotiations. Psychology applied to understand decision making in interactive scenarios and social dilemmas. Game theory provides a powerful framework for analyzing a wide range of strategic interactions and has practical applications in diverse fields where decision makers interact strategically. It continues to evolve and adapt to new challenges and applications. Augmented Reality and Virtual Reality Applications in Artificial Intelligence Augmented Reality AR and Virtual Reality VR are immersive technologies that alter our reception of the physical and digital worlds. When combined with artificial intelligence, these technologies can create powerful and transformative experiences. Here are some applications of AR and VR in conjunction with AI, enhanced user interfaces, AR and VR can provide intuitive and interactive user interfaces. AI algorithms enhance user experiences by understanding user behavior, preferences and providing personalized interactions. Training and Simulation VR is used for realistic training simulations, especially in fields like healthcare, aviation, and military. AI algorithms can adapt scenarios based on the user's performance, creating personalized and dynamic training environments. AR navigation and wayfinding. AR overlays digital information onto the real world, environment enhancing navigation and wayfinding. AI algorithms analyze real-time data to provide context-aware information such as route recommendations, points of interest, and navigation cues. Immersive Learning VR can create immersive educational experiences. AI-driven adaptive learning systems can customize content based on individual learning styles, progress, and areas of improvement. Healthcare and medical training. VR is used for medical training simulations and surgical procedures. AI algorithms can enhance patient specific simulations, provide feedback, and adapt scenarios based on the trainee's performance. Virtual conferencing and collaboration. VR can transform remote collaboration by creating virtual meeting spaces. AI powered features such as real-time language translation, gesture recognition, and intelligent content analysis, enhance communication and collaboration. AR in retail. AR applications enable virtual try-ons and product visualization. AI algorithms can analyze user preferences, recommend personalized products, and provide a more immersive shopping experience. VR Therapy and Mental Health VR is used in therapeutic applications for treating mental health issues. AI algorithms can customize therapeutic experiences based on individual patient responses, adapting interventions for better efficacy. AR in Manufacturing and Maintenance AR overlays real-time information onto machinery, aiding in maintenance and troubleshooting. AI algorithms analyze equipment data, 
predict potential failures and provide maintenance recommendations. Gaming and entertainment, VR gaming experiences are enhanced with AI driven features such as dynamic storytelling, adaptive difficulty levels and personalized content recommendations. Gaming and entertainment, VR gaming experiences are enhanced with AI driven features such as dynamic storytelling, adaptive difficulty levels and personalized content recommendations AR in tourism. AR enhances tourism experiences by providing context aware information about landmarks, historical sites and points of interest. AI algorithms can analyze user preferences to offer personalized recommendations. Immersive Storytelling VR is used for immersive storytelling experiences. AI algorithms can adapt narrative based on user interactions, creating dynamic and personalized storylines. Data Visualization VR can provide immersive data visualization experiences. AI algorithms help interpret complex data sets, identify patterns, and present insights in a more interactive and engaging manners. Gesture and Speech Recognition AI-powered gesture and speech recognition technologies enhance user interactions in AR and VR environments, allowing users to interact with digital content in more natural ways. The combination of AR, VR and AI opens up a wide range of possibilities across various industries, transforming how we interact with information learn, collaborate, and experience the world around us. As these technologies continue to advance, their integration will likely lead to even more innovative applications. Edge computing for artificial intelligence. Edge computing involves processing data closer to the source of data generation rather than relying solely on centralized cloud servers. When combined with artificial intelligence, Edge computing becomes a powerful paradigm for enabling real-time decentralized and efficient artificial intelligence applications. Here are some key aspects of edge computing for AI. Reduced latency. Edge computing reduces the latency in AI applications by processing data locally, minimizing the time it takes for data to travel between the source and the centralized cloud server. This is crucial for applications requiring real-time responses such as autonomous vehicles or industrial automation. Bandwidth efficiency. By processing data at the edge, only relevant information needs to be transmitted to the cloud. Reducing the demand on network bandwidth. This is particularly important in scenarios where bandwidth is limited or costly. Privacy and security. Edge computing addresses privacy concerns by processing sensitive data locally without sending it to a central cloud. This is crucial in applications where data security and privacy are paramount, such as healthcare or surveillance. Decentralized AI inference. AI inference, the process of applying trained models to new data can be performed at the edge, <clears throat> allowing devices to make intelligent decisions without relying on constant connectivity to the cloud. This is beneficial for edge devices like IoT sensors and cameras. Offline AI Edge computing enables AI applications to function offline or with intermittent con connectivity. This is valuable in remote locations or environments with unreliable network connectivity. Real-time decision making. Edge computing allows for real-time decision making as AI models can analyze and act on data immediately without the need to send data to a distant cloud server and wait for a response. Edge devices and sensors. Edge devices such as sensors and cameras can perform AI processing locally, <clears throat> making them more intelligent and responsive. This is particularly relevant in applications like smart cities, industrial IoT, and smart home. 
एज टू क्लाउड सिनर्जी एज कंप्यूटिंग कंप्लीमेंट्स क्लाउड कंप्यूटिंग क्रिएटिंग अनर्जी बिटवीन द टू सम प्रोसेसिंग कैन अकर एट द एज फॉर इमीजिएट रिस्पॉन्सिस वाइल मोर इंटेंसिव टास्क कैन बी ऑफ लोडेड टू द क्लाउड फॉर इन डेप्थ एनालिसिस एनर्जी एफिशेंसी प्रोसेसिंग डेटा एट द एज रिड्यूसिस द नीड फॉर ट्रांसमिटिंग लार्ज अमाउंट्स ऑफ डेटा ओवर द नेटवर्क रिजल्टिंग इन एनर्जी सेविंग्स This is critical for battery powered devices and applications in energy constrained environments. Customized AI models. Edge computing allows the deployment of customized AI models tailored to specific edge devices and their capabilities. The optimization enhances efficiency and reduces resource requirements. Robustness in unstable networks. Edge computing makes AI applications more robust in environments with unstable or intermittent network connectivity critical functions can continue to operate locally ensure system stability edge ai platforms the development of specialized platforms for edge ai facilitates the deployment management and monitoring of ai applications at the edge these platforms often include tools for model deployment updates and security automated processes at the edge edge computing enables automation and intelligent decision making directly at the edge of the network reducing the need for manual intervention and enhancing operational efficiency edge computing for ai is evolving rapidly with advancements in hardware software and communication technologies This paradigm shift is essential for unlocking the full potential of AI in real world applications especially those requiring low latency privacy and efficient use of resources explainable AI <coughs> explainable AI refers to the set of methods and techniques in artificial intelligence that aim to make the decision making processes of AI systems understandable and interpretable by humans The need for explainability arises as AI systems particularly machine learning models become more complex and are applied to critical domains such as healthcare finance and criminal justice understanding why and how AI systems make specific decisions is crucial for building trust ensuring accountability and addressing ethical concerns key aspects of explainable ai interpretability versus explainability interpretability refers to the degree to which a human can understand the cause and effect relationships in a system explainability on the other hand focuses on providing reasons or justifications for specific outcomes both are important aspects of xai transparency transparent ai systems are those where the internal workings are clear and easily understandable transparency enhances trust in ai systems especially in sensitive applications where decisions can have significant consequences model agnostic techniques model agnostic methods can be applied to any machine learning model allowing for a more general approach to xai examples include line local interpretable model agnostic explanations and shap shapley additive explanations local versus global explanations local explanations focus on understanding the decision making process for a specific instance or predictions Global explanations aim to provide insights into the overall behavior of the model across the entire data sets. Feature importance. Understanding the importance of different features in a model's decision making process is a common approach to explainability. Feature importance methods highlight which input features contribute most to a particular prediction. Rule based systems rule based systems including decision trees and rule lists provide a transparent way of presenting decision logic 
these systems are inherently interpretable making them useful in applications where transparency is a priority counterfactual explanations counterfactual explanations show how small changes in input features would have led to different model predictions these explanations help users understand the sensitivity of the model to input changes human readable outputs xai methods aim to produce human readable outputs that can be easily understood by non experts this includes visualizations textual explanations or simple rules that convey the model's reasoning ethical considerations xai addresses ethical concerns related to biased or unfair ai decisions by providing insights into the decision making process stakeholders can assess and mitigate potential biases in the model regulatory compliance in some industries regulatory frameworks require ai systems to be explainable xai helps organizations comply with regulations by providing transparency and accountability in decision making human in the loop xai often involves incorporating human feedback into the model training and decision making processes this human in the loop approach ensures that ai systems align with human values and expectations challenges of xai despite its importance implementing xai can be challenging some complex models such as deep neural networks may not be inherently interpretable balancing the trade off between model accuracy and interpretability is an ongoing challenge benefits of explainable ai trust and acceptance explainable ai fosters trust in ai systems making users more willing to accept and rely on automated decisions detecting biases and errors xai helps identify biases and errors in the decision making process allowing for corrective actions and improvements accountability and compliance xai supports accountability enabling organizations to explain and justify their ai driven decisions to stakeholders regulatory bodies and the general public user understanding users including non technical stakeholders can better understand the decisions made by ai systems leading to improved ethical decision making xai aids in addressing ethical concerns related to ai ensuring that decision making aligns with ethical standards and values in summary explainable ai is a crucial aspect of the development and deployment of ai systems providing transparency accountability and user understanding as ai continues to play an increasingly prominent role in various domains the need for effective xai methods becomes more pronounced automated planning and scheduling automated planning and scheduling aps is a field of artificial intelligence that focuses on developing systems capable of generating plans and schedules to achieve specific goals these systems are designed to automatically generate sequences of actions or events in a way that optimizes resource utilization minimizes costs and satisfies constraints aps is widely used in various domains including manufacturing logistics project management and robotics key concepts in automated planning and scheduling planning planning involves determining a sequence of actions that transforms an initial state to a desired goal state it considers the available resources constraints and the desired outcomes scheduling scheduling is the allocation of resources and time to tasks in order to optimize the overall efficiency and meet specific objectives it involves assigning start times durations and resources to each task goals and objectives 
automated planning and scheduling systems work towards achieving specific goals or objectives. Considering various factors such as time constraints, resource availability and cost considerations. Action representation. Actions are represented in a formal language specifying what can be done, the conditions under which an action can be executed and the effects of the action on the state of the system. State space. The state space represents all possible states that a system can be in. Automated planners navigate this space to determine a sequence of actions leading from an initial state to a goal state. Heuristics. Heuristics are rules or strategies used to guide the search for a solution in a more efficient manner. They help automated planners explore the state space effectively. Constraints. Constraints are restrictions or limitations that must be considered during planning and scheduling. They may include resource constraints, temporal constraints or task dependencies. Optimization criteria. Automated planning and scheduling systems often incorporate optimization criteria such as minimizing costs, maximizing resource utilization or meeting deadlines. Temporal Planning. Temporal planning involves considering the temporal aspects of actions, ensuring that actions are performed in the correct sequence and within specified time frames. Resource allocation. Resource allocation is crucial aspect of scheduling involving the assignment of resources to tasks in an optimal manner to achieve the desired objectives. Uncertainty and contingency Planning. Some systems incorporate elements of uncertainty and contingency planning, allowing for adaptation to unexpected events or changes in the environment. Integration with other systems. Automated planning and scheduling systems may be integrated with other information systems such as enterprise resource planning ERP systems to ensure seamless coordination and communication. Manufacturing. APS is used in manufacturing to optimize production schedules, manage resources and ensure efficient utilization of machinery. Logistics and supply chain. In logistics and supply chain management, APS helps optimize the transportation of goods, manage inventory and plan distribution routes. Project Management APS is applied in project management to create schedules, allocate resources and ensure that project milestones are achieved on time. Robotics In robotics, APS is used to plan the movements and actions of robots to accomplish tasks efficiently and avoid collisions. Healthcare APS is employed in healthcare for scheduling patient appointments optimizing the use of medical resources and managing hospital workflows. Aerospace In aerospace, APS is utilized for mission planning, scheduling satellite operations and optimizing the use of space resources. Energy Management APS is applied in energy management to optimize the scheduling of energy production and distribution, considering factors like demand fluctuations and resource availability. Telecommunications APS is used in telecommunications for scheduling maintenance tasks, optimizing network configurations and managing communication resources. Automated planning and scheduling systems have evolved to handle complex scenarios and dynamic en environments. They play a crucial role in optimizing operations, improving efficiency and ensuring effective resource utilization across various industries. Human AI collaboration. Human AI collaboration refers to the integration and cooperation between humans and artificial intelligence systems to achieve common goals. This collaborative approach recognizes that both human and AI capabilities can complement each other, leading to enhanced problem solving, decision making and overall performance. The aim is to leverage the strengths of both entities to create more intelligent, efficient and effective systems. 
complementary skills humans and artificial intelligence systems often possesses complementary skills while humans excel in creativity intuition and emotional intelligence artificial intelligence systems can analyze vast amounts of data quickly identify patterns and perform repetitive tasks with precision cognitive augmentation ai systems can augment human cognitive abilities by providing relevant information suggesting solutions and automating routine tasks this augmentation enhances human decision making and problem solving capabilities automation of repetitive tasks ai excels at automating routine and repetitive tasks freeing up human workers to focus on more complex and creative aspects of their jobs this leads to increased productivity and job satisfaction decision support systems ai powered decision support systems assist humans in making informed decisions by analyzing data identifying trends and providing relevant insights this collaboration improves the quality and accuracy of decision making natural language processing natural language processing enables more natural and intuitive interactions between humans and ai systems voice assistants chatbots and language understanding capabilities facilitate seamless communication and collaboration explainable ai integrating explainable ai methods ensure that ai driven decisions are transparent and understandable to humans this transparency is crucial for building trust and facilitating collaboration human in the loop system human in the loop systems involve human oversight and intervention in ai processes humans contribute domain expertise validate ai outputs and guide the system when faced with ambiguous situations training and continuous learning humans play a crucial role in training ai models providing labeled data and ensuring the system adapts to evolving circumstances continuous learning mechanisms enable ai systems to improve over time with human guidance collaborative robotics and in industrial settings collaborative robots or cobots work alongside human workers enhancing efficiency and safety these robots can handle repetitive or dangerous tasks allowing humans to focus on more complex responsibilities creative collaboration ai systems can contribute to creative processes such as content creation design and innovation they can generate ideas suggest improvements and assist in the creative decision making process healthcare assistants ai collaborates with healthcare professionals in diagnostics treatment planning and patient care it analyzes medical data assists in identifying patterns and supports personalized treatment plans customer service and interaction ai powered chatbots and virtual assistants handle routine customer inquiries allowing human customer service agents to address more complex issues this improves response times and customer satisfaction ethical considerations human ai collaboration involves addressing ethical considerations including bias mitigation fairness accountability and transparency ensuring that ai systems align with human values is essential for responsible collaboration user friendly interface developing user friendly interfaces is crucial for effective collaboration ai systems should present information in a way that is easily understandable for humans fostering better communication remote collaboration human ai collaboration extends to remote work scenarios where ai tools facilitate virtual collaboration data analysis and decision making among distributed teams the success of human ai collaboration depends on effective communication trust building and a shared understanding of goals as ai technology continues to advance finding ways to seamlessly integrate ai into various aspects of human work and life will be key 
to realizing the full potential of this collaborative approach. Hello viewers, today we have completed our journey from machine learning to end for the roadmap of artificial intelligence. Now we are starting closing comments. The roadmap was discussed covers a broad range of topics related to artificial intelligence providing a comprehensive overview. However, it's worth nothing that the field of artificial intelligence is vast and continuously evolving depending on your specific in interests and goals. There might be additional specialized areas for emerging topics that you may want to explore. Here are a few areas that could be considered depending on your preferences. AI in specific industries. Explore how artificial intelligence is applied in industries such as finance, healthcare, cybersecurity, or entertainment. Each industry has unique challenges and applications for artificial intelligence. AI ethics and responsible artificial intelligence. Understand the ethical considerations and responsible practices in artificial intelligence development, addressing issues like bias, fairness, transparency, and accountability. Artificial intelligence and the arts. Explore the intersection of artificial intelligence and creative fields such as generative art, music composition, and storytelling. Artificial intelligence hardware. Gain insights into specialized hardware for artificial intelligence like graphics, processing units, GPUs, and tensor processing units, TPUs, and understand their role in accelerating artificial intelligence computations. Artificial intelligence research and advanced topics. Dive into research papers, attend conferences, and explore advanced topics in artificial intelligence including the latest developments in deep learning, reinforcement learning, and unsupervised learning. Artificial intelligence in natural sciences. Investigate how artificial intelligence is applied in natural sciences such as physics, chemistry, and biology. For data analysis, simulations, and scientific discovery. Artificial intelligence policy and regulation. Explore the regulatory landscape and policies surrounding artificial intelligence both globally and in specific regions as governments and organizations work to establish guidelines for ethical artificial intelligence use. Remember that artificial intelligence is a vast and interdisciplinary field so you can tailor your learning journey based on your specific interests and career goals. Stay curious, explore different applications and keep an eye on emerging trends in artificial intelligence. If you have more specific areas you would like to delve into, feel free to ask for guidance. And viewers, please like, share and subscribe Aratech.